Eiffel. London, 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 London. This is Coogan Cassius Rye from London. We're at the Muscle Limit Gym here in Enfield. With me, I've got welterweight boxer uh, Matt McCarthy. Matt, you just had a, a workout there. How do you feel after that? Yeah, I feel, I feel good. It's just coming on. My shots are coming better. But yeah, just training hard, really. So. Well, what's the atmosphere like in this gym? Obviously, there's a lot of banter going on between you and the other boys and the coach, Kev. Um, you know, what's it like? It's good, like. All the, all the boys are around the same weight, around the same age, you have a good time, like you train harder when there's a few in the gym. Like you get a lot of people in the gym, so that sort of pushes you a bit more to do what you've got to do, so it's good. You have got to be one of the most vainest boxers I've ever come across, and I've interviewed a lot of boxers, and you must be, because I've just locked you, do your squats, and look at yourself in the mirror about 25 times. Uh, would you say this was true? Uh, I ain't gonna disagree with you, but look, I can't help it. Do you know what I mean? Like, You're just trying to build your personality, aren't you? That's it. Do you know what I mean? You just gotta make yourself look good, you So. <laughs> <laughs> now, is it also true that you specially shaved your chest? This is what the boys have told me. You've especially shaved your chest for today's filming. Is this true? Uh, no, nah, it's not true. But I do shave my chest. Yeah. Nothing wrong with it. Just had to get it out, didn't you? See the boys over there laughing at it. So it's good. Yeah, I do shave my chest. Yeah. Now, Matt, you haven't had your first pro fight yet. When are you looking to first go out? Uh, my first pro fight will be at May the 20th at York Hall, Bethnal Green. Uh, left jab promotion, so just training up there. I'll start camp on the 25th of March, so I'll knuckle down and just sort of settle in well, really. Yeah. I mean, the world weight division is a tough division uh, in this country and also abroad. Um, what sort of world weights in this country do you look, look up to a little bit, you know, and, and, and aspire to be? I don't know really, I've watched most of them and there's, like, there don't seem to be much talent in the world weight, not saying like, there's not good boys, but Ricky Atten was like, he was the top man since he left, like, there's not much great talent in there, but there's some good up coming boys, so I don't know really, he's Ricky Atten. What, Kev Campion, what, what's he like, because obviously I've been speaking to Kev for a while now and obviously been hearing good things about Kev, so you know, what's he like as a coach and a trainer? Uh, Kevin's a top bloke, like, he took me from the amateurs. Like it's made me turn into my shots more. I've been I've been at the camp for about two months and I've learned so much, I've learned more in the two months than what I have started. I first started at Tilbury Docks at uh, Mick Worrell's gym and I now moved to Chebel. But since I've been here I've started turning into my shots, everything's come up. He's a great coach and I've learnt loads since I've been here. So hopefully get some fights under the belt and get some good wins with him. So I see as well a lot of the you know the other boxers here that you sort of support each other, so you're always helping each other with different you know techniques and things like that. So you know um, you know how useful is that to you? You know learning off all the other boys who are not not in a, a, a dissimilar position to what you're in. A couple of them have had more obviously a fight more than you, but you know they're all more or less in the same boat at the moment, aren't you? Yeah, it's good. Like Luke is at a fight, Scott's at a fight. Do you know what I mean? We're all in the same age. We could learn, all learn from each other, like push each other in training, like we're all on the same level, it's good for us all to step up at the same time. But other than that, it's good. Like there's good boys in the gym, good sparring, that's good really, so yeah. Tell me something about Matt McCarthy that no one knows. Uh, I don't really know. Poser, that's about it really. Wait, listen, everyone knows you're a poser. I've only known you five minutes and I know you're a poser, so tell me something we don't know. Uh, I don't know. Shave my chest, that's about it. I think every, everyone knows that as well. But um, a lot of people in the gym do now. It's like there's a lot of people in the gym, and it's sort of got about. But you know, some people don't got different things about them. Like like yourself, you don't share your wine gums. But uh, you know that's just part of it. Everyone has things, you know. I don't share wine gums. I have no problem about saying that on camera. I opened up a pack of wine gums in the car up here, and I didn't offer Kev, Luke, uh, Kev's wife, or Matt a single one. And I'm not, I'm, you know, I'm, I admit it. All I can say is you love your wine gum. That's about it. They didn't even get off with the chewing gum, but what can you say? Matt, listen, like I said, I've, you know, I've spoken to Scott Hartley about this earlier. How, how difficult is it going to be for you to get your name out there first? Like I said, boxing-wise, obviously you want to get a few four-round uh, ties under your, un, under your belt and you know move up the rounds. But how hard is it for you going to get your name, Matt McCarthy, out there? Well, I think after I've had some good wins, like a lot of people from my area, from Tilbury, they all support me the boxing, they love it. So I'll have a lot of people come to the shows. Like we'll have Luke fans, Scots fans, we'll all be there. And hopefully I'll be stepping up a fight at a time, and hopefully I'll get, I'll get the support and I'll, a lot of people will see how good we actually all are. So that's about it really, so good. All right, well Matt, thank you very much for talking to iFilm London. And uh, listen, we'll hopefully catch up with you at your next fight. Yeah, that'd be good. York Gold, the 20th, be good, so thank you. Right, this is Coogan Cassius with uh, Matt McCarthy here for iFilm London at Muscle Limit Gym. Thank you very much. I'm Matt McCarthy and you're watching iFilm London.
Eiffel. Blond, blond, blond. Eiffel. Blond, blond, blond.